yeah, in Holland it's a lot of times uh, bad weather and freezing and uh, not every time I can go on the road. So I do other stuff um, than road cycling. I go uh, mountain biking a lot and also on the track. And uh, the nationals on the track are always in between Christmas and New Year. So that's a good, yeah, for me, uh, always a good moment to, yeah, to work towards too. And as a yeah, first step for my next season. The warm, warm up for if you do like a 3K pursuit or a 4K pursuit, um, yeah, normally you have to build up a little bit of lactate and um, yeah, everything must be open, you must be sweating. Um, but you, uh, y uh, you try uh, not to become really tired, so um, it has to be pretty short, but also you want to be uh, every that everything is open and you are sweating and that your heart rate is really high. So you have to do this yeah, pretty focused and uh, sometimes I use uh, music uh, to, to get uh, you concentrated and um, you try to focus on your pedaling, that everything is pretty smooth. Um, you try to focus on, uh, on your training, on your, uh, on your race. So after the warm-up uh, I get on the track and uh, uh, today I did mainly speed work, um, not too intense, but uh, just let the legs uh, feel the right rhythm, so high cadence, um, especially after Fuerteventura. Ventura. Uh, yeah, we trained uh, a lot of power, a lot of sprints and uh, a lot of resistance and now I try to um, yeah, to get the muscles also fast, just behind the journey, not a, not big gear, uh, high cadence, and sometimes really high speed also. So, in a, for example, in a race, in a sprint, the last 10k, they go on really uh, high speed. So your cadence is also becoming higher. Normally, when I look back in the race, it's um, sometimes yeah, average like 100 or 105 RPM. 110 sometimes, but also with high watts. And yeah, to train this, you have to be also really concentrated. And I like to do it on the track because I can go behind a motorbike and to 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 train like the same watts, but even higher RPM. And sometimes I do the same watts with lower RPM. But uh, yeah, it's an it's an easy way to do. To, to get adapted to, to the road racing. And um, this training I do uh, sometimes, uh, every season I do it just before the, the race season starts. So it's uh, the, yeah, the, f the finishing touch for me.